Hello, I'm Lance Great House. Welcome to my shop. This is Wheelchair Labs. Um, it's a little garage in Phoenix, Arizona. Me and my volunteers, we take wheelchairs in, we refurbish them, put new batteries in, and send them to people that really need them. A lot of people ask me, why wheelchairs? Whatever got me started was something crazy like wheelchairs. Well, I've always liked to tinker with stuff and tear stuff apart. And my dad did custom cars and antique cars and did all that as a kid. And the next step was my dad always had a problem with the electrical system, so I went to school and got a degree in electronics computers so I could wire his cars basically. But after that, I kind of got interested in robots and stuff. And so I went and I was in that show Robot Wars and Battle Bots and Junkyard Wars and all that stuff, which is a blast. And then I was introduced to Burning Man and I did a lot of fire art and different props for TV and stuff. And I was having a great time, but uh, then my brother got ill. Uh, we worked together in a little small company for like almost 15 years and then one day he started kind of limping a little bit. We couldn't figure out what was going on. Long story short, uh, within five years he passed away. He got some kind of weird form of Parkinson's and went from a racquetball playing big giant strong guy to in a wheelchair my mom feeding him. And I just noticed how when he was in the wheelchair people to treated him totally different than the guy I knew. It was like oh what happened to him and stuff so I decided to make a really cool wheelchair. We fab cars just make a wheelchair really cool. And, just the results of the people, how they interacted with them was totally different. Instead of like walking up, it's like, oh, what happened to you? It's like, wow, dude, where'd you get that awesome wheelchair? Tell us about it. Well, since he's passed, I've, to honor his memory, I kind of put everything else aside and I focus on wheelchairs. This is our sci-fi chair. We just recently took this to the LA Expo. And like I said, we could get tons of stuff like this out to people. This and regular wheelchairs, if we could just get some help with the batteries and get some more people over here working. I mean, we have tons of wheelchairs. We, if we get the batteries and get some people on them, we can get help a lot of people out there. My name is Frank Davis. The last 10 years of uh, my life here, I've needed a scooter. And so it came about that I needed help last summer in a uh, big way because my scooter bailed out on me. I said, can you fix it? He fixed it for me. But he couldn't find wheels uh, that were soft tired rather than the hard rubber and so, all of a sudden, he, behind my back, grabs this big, beautiful, blue, brand new, spanking, beautiful scooter and was pushing it up the ramps into my van. And I said, well, what are you doing, Lance? He said, I couldn't find you any new tires, so I'm giving you a new scooter, Frank. Talk about it. He's an angel. There's nothing now that I can't do. I can go to the Arabian Horse Show, which I did this summer. It's my Cadillac. My name is Karen Spencer, and I had polio as a baby, and I walked until about 10 years ago, so I've been using the chair approximately 10, 12 years. My name is Jean Mariki. I've been in the chair for hmm, going on 20 years. I needed my house chair uh, repaired. The back tires were deflated and I really couldn't get around with it. <laughs> and I'm like, if I don't get it fixed, how am I gonna function? And he took care of it for me. My name is Christine Woods. I've been in the chair a, cu a couple months. Lance and his wife are just so amazing. They gave me my life back because I had a push chair. I just didn't have enough strength to take my six-year-old around the block uh, or to walk my dog. And he gave me this nice power chair so that I could take them to the bar uh, or just walk them around the block. Uh, Lance is, um, to say he's one of a kind is such an understatement. He's, he gets it. And uh, I've worked with a lot of people that, you know, help you with wheelchairs and, and they don't get it. And he is an advocate for us as well as getting us chairs in a timely manner, which is very rare. And he, he just understands everything about our, our needs, kind of intuitively. And he's, uh, he goes above and beyond above and beyond is that's another understatement we just can't do enough for you and he's an angel he is a very very special person
Yeah, I'm going to have a bath. Okay, fine. Wait, you're so beast down.